My inheritance is walking in to the promises, the blessings that God has written in here. To enjoy my inheritance. The wonderful blessings of God written in the holy pages of the Bible. The victories are ours. They're all recorded. Now this is not talking about heaven. Canaan wasn't a type of heaven because there's no giants in heaven. The giants are here. The problems we face are here. But even so, we can overcome those giants and enjoy the victories that Christ bought for us at Calvary because great is He that's in you than he that's in the world. Amen. Amen. Praise God. So, we must follow the cloud. If we fail to follow the cloud, family, we're going to stay behind in the wilderness. Many Christians are living a wilderness experience because they do not follow God's Spirit. All right, look at that picture again. Instead of instructing the Israelites to camp at Mount Sinai and stay there for 40 years, God made them wander through the wilderness, wander through the wilderness, following the cloud for 40 years. In the daytime, they follow the cloud, at nighttime, they follow the pillar of fire. And this is to teach us to stay continually ready, stay continually ready to receive instruction from the Holy Spirit. For where God leads, God feeds. Say that, where God leads, God feeds. You see, family, those Israelites knew if they stayed behind and did not go with that cloud, they would have no food, manna, no quail, no water. Their clothes would wear out, their shoes would wear out, the spiders, huge spiders in the desert, scorpions, snakes would crowd in around them. They would die from the heat in the day, the cloud covered them and protected them from the heat. They would die from the freezing cold and desert night and the fire protected them, kept them warm at night. All their needs were met by following the cloud. That's telling you and me today, child of God, that everything we need is simply in listening and following the Holy Spirit because He's going to guide us through life. He will guide us through the storms of life and we will always wind up in the harbor of blessing, provision, prosperity, and well-being. If we follow the cloud. You understand that? That's the lesson. That's the lesson. And the cloud is always moving. The Holy Spirit is always moving. That's the type. That's the example. If we fail to follow, we will be left behind in our problems, our circumstances. And we have no one else to blame except ourselves because we are not listening and following the Holy Spirit's guidance. God wants to lead us into our inheritance. All the blessings of Calvary. Say this, God wants to lead me into my destiny. The purpose I was born for. The purpose God planned for my life before time began. God has a definite purpose, plan, destiny, for every one of us. I am fearfully and wonderfully made by the Creator and I am sent to this planet at this hour. I am here at this time for a very important assignment from God. And in that assignment is all my needs taken care of to empower me 
to fulfill my assignment. Thank you for watching Dr. Theo's YouTube channel. We will continue to offer encouraging and life-changing highlights from Dr. Theo's past, present, and future series and messages. Please take the time to like and share the videos. And most importantly, don't forget to subscribe to the channel.